ablation, the best studied is perhaps radiofrequency ablation. This is about a 45 minute procedure where uh, through the endoscope, a uh, balloon which is sized to the uh, individual's esophagus is inserted. Um, once the uh, balloon catheter is sized, a separate catheter with um, ablation electrodes are passed into the esophagus. And in a very quick burst of radiofrequency energy, uh, it's about a one to two second burst of energy, the lining of the esophagus is quickly treated. We scrape off the um, lining and then basically reablate. And uh, the patient typically requires about three to four of those treatments over time. If you look at the efficacy rates in the recent literature, this has been published actually in the New England Journal of Medicine, the outcomes are quite effective for the removal of high-grade dysplasia in Barrett's esophagus. Um, there was about an 81% response rate at one year, and for the removal of low-grade dysplasia in Barrett's esophagus, that was about 91%.